Welcome back to Banjo Tooie. Now, um, what happened? Well, uh, all right. So, uh, as you know, we're playing this on Rare Replay, right? As as you know, mm -hmm. it's uh, it's uh, one of the greatest compilations in video game history, where what? it's all the rare games in one disc. What happened? And yeah, it's made by Microsoft Studios. Yeah, very good, very good. Uh -huh. um, we we'll do something a little bit differently uh, to start things out. Um, because we have Rare Replay, we have every single rare game ever made since they started in 1984. So we'll just uh, pop on in here real quick. Yeah, sink, mm -hmm. sink the data. Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. Sinking right, yeah. data. We're probably picking up the the Kazooie and Tui uh, progress I got there. All right, all right, all right. So we'll just head to the game gallery, and uh, I want to talk about this uh, particular game here. We know Jack Pack from DK64. Uh, Lunar Jetman. I don't know much about that. Attic Attack. Well, Saber Wolf. That's what I want to talk about today. Saber Wolf. Okay. It's a, it's a it's a game that Rare made, you know, early on, '84. So you know, one of their first games they ever made. And it's for the ZX Spectrum. Sorry, ZX Spectrum. I hate uh, Spectrum games. I never really like the color palette. It just doesn't look, doesn't look good compared to the Commodore. And uh, this is how it works. You're in a jungle, uh, hoping to hunt and find the mighty Saber Wolf, as you see on the left there. Saber Wolf would appear in Killer Instinct games as a fighter. You do is just kind of swing your sword and things show up and you 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 you, you kill him and you okay. you get points. Okay. Oh, well, uh, then you get hit. You get, you get hit, which takes yeah. away a life. Okay. Oh, there's and then you got hit. Oh, there's, you got there's away a life. two. Okay. Um, and then you find this guy and the, you probably take your stuff back because he just mugged you. Just uh, well. Was that the Saber Wolf? Yeah, I'm thinking, oh, and okay. then you got hit again. Well, and you probably are dead. All right, last life. I, oh, and then well, you died. There we go. Cool. Zero percent of the adventure completed. Well, that's one way to play it, but uh, you're supposed to be moving. It is an adventure game, after all. Oh. Yes. So, uh... Yeah, it's a we didn't get very far. So what we'll do is we'll just uh, take that, head up north here. All right. All right, we go over here. Got that. You yeah, got fucking uh, right oh, out. Got got immediately. Okay. Yeah. Get hit through a tra screen okay. transition, and, and I, then we I get see. got there. Okay. Okay. Cool. Get out here. Just, and we got just, to, uh, and then well, we spawn and get got. Okay. We, have, we, we have a terrible range of attack, though. I don't think we can even attack down. Uh, oh. Which is lovely. Wait, then, oh, oh. <laughs> spawn death. Right. Hey, you got one percent. All right. Well, that's Saber Wolf. I think you get it. Let's go back to the real game now. All right, welcome back to Banjo Tooie for Realsy Reels. Uh, we're back here in Hailfire Peaks, and yes, there was a very good reason why I had that at the beginning. We'll, we'll, we'll... Are we gonna fight Killer Instinct? No, we're not fighting Fulgore. Just the in the entire game, not just Saber Wolf. The entire game of Killer Instinct. Gonna need that for later. Well, today we are finishing the rest of Hailfire Peaks. Oh, really? All of it. Okay, cool. The rest of it. Everything we missed, we're gonna do. Except for one thing we gotta do later, but uh, we can't well, do that. Then but. that's not the rest of the stuff. But all, but all the jiggies, all the all the notes, all the gingers, all the everything that we can get, we're gonna get. All the ginger snaps, all the fireworks, all the um, all the mimosas, uh, all of the all, all the, the all the mounds bars, all of the pumpkin pie slices. Every single feather off Kazooie's tail. You got know it. it. All right, icicle grotto. There's something here. I'm trying to see. What have I been missing? There's like a whole entire thing I've been missing. Then there's another move for Kazooie. Probably her best move in the game oh. that I haven't even seen yet. Does she briggle bash herself? <laughs> no. <laughs> she just falls on the ground with a giant slam. Yeah, how do you get up there? I'm thinking that there's... There's supposed to be icicles at the top that you're supposed to shoot and they drop down. Oh. But I think I'm having a hard time determining which of those icicles they are. Hmm. I'm just having a hard time here. Well, it's time to have a soft time. Let's get a bunch of pillows, surround Banjo, and then he'll be fine. Get some, yeah, get some pillows, get ah! some, get some feathers, get some, some memory foam. All right, these icicles are giving me a hard time, even because they're very hard and cold too. <sighs> it's, it's stuck to my hand. What do I do? I think maybe like up here, perhaps. Those don't look like they will move. I've, I've, I've done doing this wrong. There's, there's not even anything up here. Hmm. Is it a different area? It's gotta be. Maybe up farther? Maybe? Be my guess. There's the there's that Cheeto page in there we have yet to get. Correct. 
Hmm. And again, hmm. How, God, how curious. Can you imagine your eyeballs being on the spike of a crystal? Just, I, ow, bad time. Well, yeah, is he, is he, uh... Is he after me because uh, he wants he wants harm on me, or because he's in pain? He wants me to kill him. Help me! <laughs> hear that! Hear that haunting grunt. There we go. Oh! Could have warped here, but one. Oh, please drop all of them. God damn it! Oh yeah, right. <laughs> Thankfully, though, one drops, and then you, you get it. Okay, so no cutscenes for the entire thing. No, not for the whole thing. Thankfully. Not sure if any old egg would work, but grenades just seems to be the catch-all for anything that you need. Hey, if it works, it works. If it works, it works. Oh, more than- God, come on. I'm sick of you guys! I've noticed the later levels have a lot of, I'm just gonna take a life from you. Uh-huh. Hope you don't mind. Uh-huh. Split up pad there. No, please. Do not split us up. Not yet. Okay, fine. Need Kazooie first. She only got one life. Yeah, she does. She'll be okay. One life to live. Yeah. She jumps very far, <laughs> so you gotta be really kind of... I noticed. Oh, there's the treble clef. Oh! No! <laughs> See, that's why we split up. Okay, so... <laughs> right, right back there! Okay. <laughs> Damn it! Fuck! <laughs> I can actually see Kazooie saying those things. It's like, I'm, I overjumped the thing and. Ah! Are you okay, Kazooie? Shut up! Sh <laughs> I don't need crap from you, bear boy! Banjo used to go to Bottles for relationship advice, but now Bottles is gone. The the relationship counselor is gone here in. Uh, what would you call this place? Is this still Spiral Mountain or is there somewhere else? We're still in the Isle of Hags. We left Spiral Mountain a long time ago. Yeah. So are we next to, like, Trapezoid Tropical Island or something like that? It's just off in the distance, maybe? I think we're near, uh, Parabola Peak. Yeah, oh, okay, okay. Come out here, it brings us to, like, near the top of, uh, oh, the icy finally. side. Yes, finally. We got this move, favorite move in the game, Glide! Oh, thank you. Now this dumb bird can kind of fly a little bit. Oh, finally. I'm just saying Spyro could do this from the very beginning, which means Spyro is the more superior game. Right. Sure. How many games has he been in? Three, three good ones, plus a good remaster, and then a lot of crap. A lot of crap, huh? How much crap has Banjo Kazooie been in? Not much crap? Huh. Well, actually, all of them, if you want to be, but you know, a snob look, about look it. That. It's beautiful. Look at the way she flies like that. It's, it's fantastic. I love that you can cancel it mid-flight and then just, like, do the thing again. So now we get a nice overview of everything, but I feel like, what's the point of this? Why did I do all that? I mean, I, I, I can fly, I can do glide now, that's great. Oh, that's so good, though. But there's nothing much we can do here for now, so we go back inside the Icicle Grotto. Oh, what's that? What is that? Yeah, glide it. This is basically, uh, you know, where the icicles were. Just glide it, dude. Bench over there, and we just glide it over. Uh. Oh, okay, glide. Oh, can you do the, uh, the Mario cape thing? Nah. No, oh, it's just a a good glide. It's more like Knuckles' is gliding in Sonic Adventure. Mmm, okay. OP as hell. Because <laughs> I remember you gliding through... Con uh, I almost said country. Uh, gliding through uh, Sonic Adventure. It almost seemed like you never lost height. Well, he flies very good. But why? He's an echidna. And also, if I want to blame reality, hedgehogs don't run fast. We're in a banjo game, and you're gonna talk about how song doesn't make sense? Bears don't have birds in backpacks! They don't wear yellow shorts! Birds can't carry bears! They, they were blue shorts, that makes sense, but yellow shorts, that's just way uh -uh. too far! You know, these were white when I bought them, Kazooie. Yeah, I do, you, you do have a penchant for orange juice. <laughs> oh. Alright, let's get Mumbo to do some things. At least I think that's what we're doing here. Oh, finally. Mumbo, do your job! We could go in there, but, uh, that's very hot and we'll die. Well, I don't want Banjo to die. I don't want Kazooie to die either. Just throwing that out there. 
Lest people think I'm a kazooist. Don't need to worry about those hands. I can just jump, jump over here. Yeah, I love this shortcut. Shortcuts it's are go great. down, go down here. They're right up here. Beautiful. Beautiful. And now we fly. Oh, uh, well, well uh, I, in a manner of speaking. I mean, when, when I get flight, but mm -hmm. go up here. It just takes us up here. Down. You almost well. did it. It was so close. You could have uh, done it. I know. And now it's taught. No, I, 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 I am the fool. Yeah, Wait, let's get a little high here. Yeah, I was about to say, yeah. Start your glide looking away from the edge. And here we go. Mambo, do your job. The guy's global already. A good while ago. Here, here's your gremlin. Now do something. He has two things he can do. We can revive the alien. And there's another pad nearby there. Both of his things are in the freezy place? Yes. Okay. I'm pretty sure. Is there anything he does on the fiery side? I don't think so. No. Okay. We're eventually going to figure out what to do as a snowball, correct? Yes. Okay. E everything we need to do here that isn't tied to other courses, we will do here. For there is but one more thing to do after we're done here. But one more thing. But everything else we're gonna do. <laughs> oh, this is maddening. <laughs> oh, boy. Whoa! Something was happening there. Shadow glitches. They, they have really uh, intricate shadow details and physics in here, and I think it just kind of overwhelms the game sometimes. Well, this is the N64 slash Xbox 360. So, go over to the... Yeah, Wumba side. How many games do you think broke when they got transitioned over to higher consoles? I know you have to program a lot of uh, stuff well, extra. All of them, obviously. All of them, yes. Yeah, not heavy enough for that. Nothing up there. It just takes us back there. Okay. Okay. I'm interested to see, you know, when you bring the files into into the Microsoft console of choice, I wonder how many things they had to fix to properly port it over. I mean, not just controls, but, like, what broke? Well, I am pretty sure that for any game, especially one that has such a great time... Uh, time difference between them, like uh, Banjo-Tooie in 2000 and the Xbox release in 2009, you're going to lose a lot. Oh yeah. I think it'd be easier to take a, like, a PS3 game to like the PS5, mm. or even or even PS4 to PS5 and beyond, because the, the uh, architecture of how they're developed is kind of similar a little bit, but it's not perfect, of course. But every game is gonna break somehow because you're taking it from a place it doesn't belong into, or, like, it's, we're, you're taking this game from where everything works fine, and it's it's on the console where it's supposed to be made, and the coding works great, and it all works great. And you're gonna rip that out <laughs> and try and slam it onto some other console that doesn't know what the fuck is going on because there's all these different, you know, things. You have all the assets, you have all the text, and you have and the coding's still there, but you need to translate it to the console. See, that just reminds me of a lot of game developers actually throwing away the code after the game was made because they never thought they would be re-releasing these games. So, uh, what, what game was it? I think Kingdom Hearts was a was a victim of that. Um, it was either another Square Enix game or a Capcom game where they thought, oh, we're never going to re-release this, so they just threw away the code and had to remake it from scratch. Hmm. Well, by bringing the alien dad back to life, he says, all right, go find my three kids. So, you You got that. it. Yeah, all right. Now, if we... If we, uh get rid of Mumbo and go back to Banjo-Kazooie, does he go back to being dead? No. Okay, good. Because we need Banjo-Kazooie to get the three kids. Oh, okay. That's good. Mumbo ain't done yet, though. Time to unlock Paradise. And then he rolls snake eyes. <laughs> That's a paradise. Mm hmm Yes. Okay, there it is, over there. What could Mumbo possibly do in this cold area? Right now, oh. I have a feeling he's freezing his balls off. Mumbo no have balls. Mumbo Vow of celibacy to achieve shaman powers. 
All I had to do was give up balls. Oh, Mumbo. So sad. All right, there's the last pad over there. Okay, okay. Uh, okay. There we go. Yeah, what's this going to do? Bringing another person back to life? Yeah, we brought this guy back to life and he was, like, frozen. Oh. By Jove! It's the guy from Saber Wolf. Oh. Okay. That's Since probably why you got. Yes. That's, that's probably why you got an achievement for it. Yes. Cool. Also, he actually looks like he has frostbite. He does. He is dead. There is no bringing him back. He has lost his nose. He's lost most of his left eye. His hands are gone. Everything. <laughs> Cable. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, I'm Saber Wolf, the Cable Guy! It's Saber Man, the Cable Guy. Saber Man, the Cable Guy! So, we need to warm him up now. Do we need to use fire eggs? We need to get Banjo Kazooie back over here, so Mumbo's about done for now. Just about. What else can Mumbo do? Not much. Uh, Mumbo Beatbox. Oh, damn. Mumbo, I didn't know you had that special ability. Special shaman power. <laughs> <laughs> Mumbo's just there like... <sighs> Give him another Globo, he just starts releasing album after album. Alright, here we are back as Banjo-Kazooie over here. Just had to warp back and switch back and all that. That's five minutes I'm saving you, trust me. Fire, egg. Fire, egg. Fire, egg. And you'd be about right. Actually, grenade egg. It's very tragic what we're gonna do to this uh, saber man guy. A any kind of fire you can use will will suffice. Can you hold on to this stick of dynamite for me? I don't. Actually, I don't know if a clockwork kazooie egg will do it, but uh, or if a grenade egg. But a fire egg will absolutely do it. Aiming kazooie. There you go. You gotta do it a couple times to warm, really warm him up. Mm -hmm. Though I guarantee that's not how warming up the body works. Yeah, I mean, half of his body was technically dead. It needs to thaw. I mean, if, if I throw fire eggs on his frostbitten body, that's like gonna cause like... It's gonna hurt like it's, hell. It's, he's, he, he's dead now. We gotta mm -hmm. get Momo back and bring him back to life. Uh-huh. Well, hey, at least we'll bring him back to life better than before, maybe? So he's not done yet. It's like, oh, I need to go back to, and, get, and get some sleep. So could you take me back to my tent and sit on the fireside? I need to go back over there. Oh, that's his tent! That's his tent. How has it survived since 84? Well... <laughs> <laughs> uh-huh, I see. Old man blubbering intensifies. So, I don't know what's funnier. The fact that uh, in 2000 we're watching this character from 1984, or, you know, it's the Xbox version, so we're, we're in 2009 with this 1984 character, or the fact we're in 2021 watching this 1984 character, it just gets funnier every year. Hey, at least we have a background now. So we use a drill, a bill drill to unlock the protection sheet. Uh, 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 oh dear, this one's dead already. No. We gotta get Mumbo back here again so he can do the Mumbo pad and bring the kid back to life! Uh, really? Busy work. Busy work everywhere, all the time. Gah! Here we are with some busy work. Oh yes, my friend, it's all busy work. I hope you don't mind playing this game for hours, getting busy work. I don't mind, but I'm not happy. Uh. Hope you enjoy playing this game for hours on end. We gotta go and do some more busy work. More like busy Tui. <laughs> <laughs> more like busy Patui. <laughs> I hate it. I've gotta do the There we go. I gotta use the special power. This guy, he just, he just hops back out. All right, he's saved. Oh, good. And then straight into the water where he drowns. Tragic tale, honestly. D uh, d okay. Okay. Yeah, all right. Bye. <laughs> uh, all, right. all right. I guess he's water soluble, you know. A busy work. Uh, I'm just kidding. It's, ah! it's back. Why? Man that responds fast. It's got ten thousand kids. 
I think the capture's messing up on me here. Just a little bit. Ah, uh, come on. Oh, come on. It's basically jumping forward in time. Watch out! Watch out! So many frames of drop. Huh? It's like, oh, it's a game from 2000! Please have mercy! <laughs> Help me! God, this means a game from N64 got updated for HD and then got HD-ified again for Rare Replay. Ugh. Although I don't think they updated it to 1080. I think it's still 720p. I think it's still just the regular um, arcade edition. Is that, yes, it is. It's not like you're running a, a, a special game from within Rare Replay. It's just a link to the arcade. Yeah, can it I... Has, it has Rare Replay over it. Can I bitch about Rare Replay for one second? Like the... In the entire collection as a whole. Can I bitch about that for a second? What's the bitch about? It's the greatest. It's the greatest deal in video game history. It's not exactly the collection itself. It is actually how Microsoft handled it. Oh, well, oh well, then by all means. So you have Rare Replay, thirty rare games for thirty bucks. Amazing deal. Probably cheaper now. Probably cheaper now. Yes, because it's been out for years. Every single game that has been ported to Xbox Live Arcade during the merger. That means they are individually installed on your Xbox. So if you want to play... Now, that's not the only thing. Once they are properly installed, thanks to Rare Replay, you need to still have the Rare Replay disc in order to play the Xbox Live Arcade version of the game that the Rare Replay collection downloaded for you. That just seems silly. It is. They had to do that with Banjo-Kazooie, Banjo-Tooie, Perfect Dark, both Viva Pinatas. Nuts and Bolts, I think, is also a... Nuts and Bolts is also a separate download. And there's also just a few other uh, rare side games. I think they're like shooters or something like that. But yeah, that's like eight games that need to be separately installed. But you still need the rare replay disc to play as. <sighs> it's, it's dumb. Hey, Xbox, I hate it when you do this. With your next console, please, don't think it's a PC. Use it as a console, for God's sake. You're telling Microsoft not to think that it's a PC. Hey, Sony, same thing. Stop treating your console as a PC. It doesn't work. So we finally brought Saber Man out here, and I think there was like a Saber Wolf game for Game Boy Advance, which pro probably was a bit different. It's been 40 years. <laughs> it's been too long, and nobody remembers Saber Wolf. But I do now. I only know Saber Wolf because it was from Killer Instinct. And now that I know where it came from, it's like, oh! Oh! Well, be better there than here, yeah? <laughs> I wonder what adventures may await. <laughs> oh, that's cute. That's cute. <laughs> uh, just go back to sleep, okay? Okay. Ah, sorry, old man. Not in this lifetime. So we go ahead and do this here. Do go the impossible this thing, yeah. Go yeah, to gotcha. boiling water. Mm hmm. H2O, as you can see. Oh, I get it. That water's far too hot for our swimming pool. Wow. This links back to Jolly Roger Lagoon. It's basically the final step we need for another Jiggy from there. Oh. But, but basically, come here, hit that switch, opens that door, and it all drains out, and they get their swimming pool finally. But this is too hot. We need to find a way to cool it down. Okay. And the way to cool it down is in the next level. Oh, okay. Not like we have to do it here. It's, no, no, no. It's, so that's, that's the last thing we need to do in this that's, level. That's the thing we're not doing today, but uh, we will, we'll do... Uh, that? We'll do, we'll do it next time, actually. Okay, cool. It's all coming together. I like that. It is! It is all coming together. It's only, there's not so much... There's not too much left to do! It's taken so freaking long to get to this point. I'm sorry, Banjo-Tooie. But you're, there's just so much extra. I kind of like extra, but I like it when it's... I, I feel like I'm doing more stuff. I mean, we were talking about this earlier, you know. Uh, Donkey Kong 64 has all these levels and five different Kongs to go through, and Banjo-Tooie mm -hmm. has five different ways to go through a level. That's Banjo and Kazooie, Banjo-Kazooie, Mum uh, Mumbo, Mumbo, and then Wumbo's Transformation. Uh, uh... But... There's less to do on that. Yeah. But on the other hand, when you have five Kongs doing things, you get, like, you know, all these bananas and all these all these uh, golden bananas. So it feels like you're, do you're doing more here. I still like the flow of the original Banjo-Kazooie, though. That flowed the best, yes. Because that one we did... We. You did that in 15 parts. Donkey Kong 64 is less than that. Or more than that. Oh my god, I can't believe I said that. Almost double the amount. And then we have Tui here. How do I... 
Fucking just just line it up. He he's freezing. Warm baby, please. Uh oh, I see what they want me to do. I get it. Jump on his head and then use Kazooie's hatch. <laughs> and that warms baby up. Really? <laughs> like God, I was freezing my ass off. I like I had like frostbite up into up into my nose. And then a bird sat on my head and now I'm like, oh my god, I'm so I'm I'm sweating now. Uh, okay, well there's the second use for that move. Well, only because we can get over there anyway, so. That is true. I forgot where I put Banjo. <laughs> <laughs> where did I put my Banjo? <laughs> banjo! Banjo! Dun 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 There you are. Alright, uh, what next? You know, I was really hoping there, when you when you were describing how to cool off the pool, mm -hmm. I was really hoping, you're like, well, we need full health with Wumba, and then, you know, you just melt the snowball in you're, the- You're thinking you you turn to a snowball and you jump into the water, you yeah. think that'll melt it? Okay, yeah. that, that'll, that won't do anything but kill you. I know, but, you know, for a split second, it, it might work. I don't know. It might work, and then you die. I'm <laughs> thinking outside the box here. And so let's get up, get big a little bit. Let's get big. Big! Alright. Can't go through there. That's a, that's the last ticket we're gonna get. Can you break it? No. It can is unbreakable. You phase through it. But I can creep over here. Ah. Uh, that. That's how you do it. That opens the ice train station. There are two train stations here. Wait, why? Well, one's in the fire side, one's on the ice side, obviously. Oh, well, okay. Now what? Y you seem... I don't want to say confused, but you seem, uh... I got a little bit of now what! <laughs> not gonna lie to you, I got I got some now what going on here. Oh so god! So we gotta go to the lava side. It's that, hot! That we have to do, it is hot, you will, you will, ah! you will lose, uh, health, but you can also blast through those hands because you're ice. Oh, do that. You roll all the way up here. Uh, oh. Wait, what? And that's how you come over here. Is there and another? I, there's ideally, another button. This is how you hit that button. But we need to be a little bit bigger. Oh. And you get bigger by rolling around in snow. So I'm thinking, oh, okay, here's some snow over here by the corner. Right? Yeah, right here. That doesn't count. I already know that doesn't count. You need to do the so entire thing again. So maybe come back here, but no, that's just, that's just gonna get me down. I don't want to be able to get back up when and, I get to that size. And you can't jump as a snowball, can you? You can jump, but it's more like a, a half-hearted bounce. Hmm. Uh, you need to do it fast enough. Go through, going through the fireside. But there's snow right here. No, it's, but it's, 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 it's a texture. Powder. It's, it's right a to... texture. It could be the right texture. All I need is just some snow to get bigger. That's oh, all I need. No. I need to get one size bigger. It's not snow. Can I do it like in there? That looks. Oh, that, that, just, that leads right <laughs> to. Oh, that's not oh, good. Oh no! Oh, no, no, get out! Get out! Ah! All right, that leads right to a loading zone. So that doesn't work. Up this little nubbin here. Oh yeah, here we go. This this is what does work. That's the stuff. That's the stuff. There you go. Now we're ready. What, what is that glittering thing? Is that you? Yeah, th that's basically uh, what makes you go forward with force that will hurt people. Oh, okay. Crunch. And that extra two pounds of force. This is another problem I have with Banjo Tooie. You're thinking, oh, it's gonna it's gonna have a jiggy appear, right? Nope. It's gonna do something for something later. Okay, dig it up, dig it up. All right. It's a Jinjo. You got the jiggy, but to, oh, oh, there, there it goes, there it goes. You gotta be effing with me. No. It got it got sucked into Come Grunty Industries. I know. Uh, really? So now we gotta go back to Wumba, switch back to Banjo Kazooie, uh. and then hop in that little hole there to get the jiggy. Outstanding. Absolutely fantastic. That's the best. That's the best thing ever. Is that one for Grunty Industries? No, it, it is one for, um... For this one? Yes.
We just have to get it at Guardian Industries. The way that they set it up, it's just, it's weird. It's really weird. Okay. It's like what I thought was a, was a jiggy for this level. Well, because I went over here, it's in, it counts for this level, but it, it's it's different. Yeah, we got one in Pterodactyl Land, didn't we? Yeah, we had to go through Pterodactyl Land to get one in, in Hailfire Peaks. That is yeah. so messed up. Brought Mumbo back here. We did have to bring him back. Bring the kid back. You gotta use the same pad twice. Bring the kid back. Bring the kid back. Bring the kid back. Sorry for your loss. I can't just walk over here and just yo, uh, uh, Alica life. Yeah, it didn't work like that. <laughs> oh, I'm alive. <laughs> Thank you, Mumbo. Nope, we gotta do the shimmy and the shake and the tribal dance. Oop, oop. You think Mumbo's uh, speech is all part of his shaman teachings? Like, they taught him to speak like this? Through ancient teachings? It's like, alright, Mumbo, say the line. I don't know. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Me no, no. Me no, no. Me no, no. Me no, no. That's great! Good job! Ah, I did good. No, 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 no. Oh, sorry. Me do goo. Me do... Me too good. Well, it brings him back to life, and now all three of the aliens are... All three kids. Yeah, all three kids and their daddy. You brought a family back to life. You have done well, Earthling, but I shall now have to exterminate you all for taking so long. It was a joke. Uh, you know, Mumbo give with Mumbo take of the way. Ingo, Mumbo, Ingo! I can't actually see them fall over. Just immediately is just. Ah. <laughs> then Mumbo brings it back to life and then kills him again. Brings it back to life. You want Mumbo have true power? Ha ha ha! You want fuck with Mumbo? No. The, no. You then Mumbo comes not. out of her tough, of her tent, like <sighs> snaps her fingers, and then, and then all four of them just kind of come together in some singular awful amalgamation. Here's a jiggy. Hooray! All right, back to banjo. And Kazooie. I mean, yeah. What are we doing right now? Well, they're gonna go uh, get that Jiggy that we unlocked. Going to get the Jiggy. Going to get it. Gotta go to Grunty Industries to yeah. get the Jiggy. We gotta go through that hole which will take us to Grunty Industries, but there's no way to get into Grunty Industries from there. It's it's just, we're in it and we got it. It's, it's, it's what? Good. It's this old thing. We gotta go through this hole, basically, in order to go to Gundry Industries in order fit to through get- through there? Oh, you have got to be that mother That was just to show it me. off. That was just to show it off, I can't believe it! No, no. We have to come back as Banjo. Banjo has to get into his little shack, his, his little sack or whatever. So that way he's small enough to get in there and get the jiggy. Oh, busy so, all right, work. I'll just go over here and hop up here and- do a little there we go. bit of busy work. So it'll be forever to figure that out. That's the only way to get up these ledges. What, the... the... the no Kazooie jump? Yeah. It's awful. So, uh, which is... Okay, I think that's it. Kazooie yeah. only. There we oh, go. damn it. Oh, here we are. Got it. Ridiculous. Re goddamn ridiculous. So what's our totals looking like now? <laughs> Give me those totals, please. We have one Jinjo, two Jiggies in uh, Grand Industries, but we only have uh... ten notes and one Jiggy and, uh, and a honeycomb and a page left. Okay. Can we get that in less than ten minutes? Uh. We'll see. Let's go. I mean, if I were playing, then no. <laughs> no, it wouldn't happen. All right. Let's see. The last Jiggy is behind a ice wall, yes? Yes. That's tied to the train station. S same with the Cheeto page. Yes. And I haven't even seen the third honeycomb, so... You're on your own, Chief! Ah, just All gonna... right, let's get let's get to work then. Yeah, just gotta sit back and relax. Just, just, just let Uncle UDJ take care of the rest <laughs> of Hail, Pi Hail Fire Peaks for you. Thanks, Uncle UDJ! I don't like being an uncle. I'd rather be, uh... Great aunt cousin, twice removed. <laughs> on your mother's side. On my dad's side. Oh. On my on my dad mom's side. 
My family's a bit everywhere. I hope you don't mind. Oh, excuse me? You can climb up that. And then you... What? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh! Oh, Alright, cool. so you come back to Spanjo so you can climb up the motherfucking icicle. <laughs> so you can go do the thing. You can come do, you can do the thing. You can go through here. And that's how you get the Cheeto page. Guys, we need a reason for Banjo to be alone. We came up with this power. We need the player to use it. What do we do? Uh, add 10 extra hours of gameplay? You got it, friend. Man. We gotta treat this game like a football player. Add more padding! Because it'll give the players a concussion. <laughs> As they bang their head against the wall. So why out. can't you fit through the fucking hole? Uh, we just have to reshape Kazooie. I mean, why do we even need the pad to remove the bird from the backpack? Like, seriously, is there a story reason why we need the pad in the first place? No, it's, it's just it's just the pad. The, the split up pad is what makes us do it. No, but I could literally just go, hey, Kazooie, get out of the bag. And she'd be like, oh, okay. Why can't we just do that? That's kind of like her nest. She needs, like, special, magical, military secrets to get out. What if it was a practical joke by Mumbo and he secretly enchanted the bag? So that as soon as she's in there, she's not coming out. Oh. And your controller. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> uh, it's a double A. All right, here we go. Uh, there we go. There uh, we go. Okay, cool. All right. Couple, couple double A's and Phew. we're off right. to the races. Actually, Microsoft, why haven't you upgraded to the rechargeable battery pack in your controllers yet? I know there are some controllers to do, that do that, but we're still... I'm on Xbox Series X right now, and you're still using batteries. They're still using batteries in the Series X? Yeah. You gotta be kidding me. No. Still? Two double A's. No option for rechargeable... Like, like there might be rechargeable battery packs out there. But I haven't gotten them, because that's more money. Ugh. <sighs> Well, what's more money, uh, getting a rechargeable pack or buying all the batteries? Honestly, in the in the long run, because I don't play video games anymore, <laughs> it, it might be cheaper just to buy the batteries. All right, let's get the last jiggy. It's called Chuffy over here. Chuffy? Chuffy. Chuff. Chuff and stuff. Oh, I thought it was just gonna blast off at the speed of light. Let me tell you about trains. See, it's force equals mass and acceleration, and uh, it needs a lot of force and a lot of acceleration, and it's got a lot of cars holding it back, too, so. But if train A leaves the station at 4 a.m. and is going 45 miles per hour, how long will it take train B to collide with a car A? So the problem here is that the engine is overheating now. Are you fucking kidding? They added more? There's the last honeycomb, by the way, over there. The they added more to the advancement? Well, yeah. I mean, you can't just bring the train over here. What? Well, but yes, you can. It's, it's too hot. You should be able to. It's way too hot. Realism in my game about Baron Bird. And then you just jump into the... Oh, clever, clever man. I almost said clever girl, but you're neither a girl nor a raptor. All right, so the pool. We get in the pool? No, we're getting the jiggy, you said. Yes, well, while I was searching where to go, I found the last ten notes here. Oh! Ba -ba -da -ba -da -ba 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 -ba. So that's nice. How many notes are total? 900. 900? Okay, so yeah, we're close. Which means I have all the no all the notes from Isla Hags, too. Ah, nice. It's one more level. Wait a minute, do we have to make the camel lose his water to cool off the train? <laughs> it's tradition! Yes! Hey, right, come on over here. It, oh, oh, please, please, not my precious water again! Yes, your precious water again! Because it falls right into the engine, which cools it down enough for it to keep going. Ah, cool. Do it again, do it again! <laughs> Pull your jets, man, I'll get you there. So now we can go to the ice side. Gotcha. Okay. That makes a bit more sense, I guess. Transition. Oh, you still have to do the thing? Yeah, you gotta, gotta go. Well, we actually gotta tell him where to go. I guess. Well, a bird! Go, Chaffee, go! By the way, this is the only way to get into the ice station. 
Is it covered in ice? No, oh, just this is the only way. Oh. Uh, uh. I thought it crashed. <laughs> no, no, please, no. I know where we are now. The jiggy is right next to us, isn't it? <laughs> Don't tell me the train's in the way. Oh, n n nothing like that. Okay, good. I mean, you gotta get out of here somehow. But aside from quitting the game. <laughs> I quit! Uh, hmm. Okay, well, I guess first things first, we'll head up here. I saw a Jinjo up there, but I doubt it's real. Yeah, yeah it was black when real. it started, now it's now it's perp. Yeah, it's pink. Alright, yeah, well... Lawyer. There's an imposter among us. I found him. It was pink all along. So we go through here and there. Ta da! It is. Uh, the yeah. final jiggy! <laughs> so, viewing the totals now, I believe that is everything. That's a good number to end on, by the way. 64? Yes. Hell yeah. Oh, love it. It only took me over a little over two and a half hours to do it. <sighs> oh, it has a count for every level. That's amazing. Oh, yay! Well, that is it. That is the yeah. that is the uh, next to last level of Banjo Tooie. Uh, the next place we're going now is my favorite level. Oh, I'm glad we're ending on a high note. Yep. And because D Duck Kong 64 is uh, taken care of, Banjo Tooie will now be on Saturdays and Sundays until the series is over. So. See you on Saturday, and see you next time for Banjo-Tooie. All aboard for the Fun Express. I like fun.